What is going on guys, Casual Savage here and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to add multiple strokes in Photoshop. Now just before I get into this video, like I say, this is a requested tutorial as you see on the screen right now. I got this asked to me on Twitter. With that being said, if you'd like to request a tutorial, then be sure to leave it in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. So right now I'm just going to add on some text, and this is just going to be called YouTube. Okay, so I've added red text simply so you can see the different stroke colours we're going to use. So the first things first, we just come here and add a normal stroke like we normally would. And then we could just put it up a bit. And there you go, you can see there is a black stroke on there, just the normal way we usually add one stroke. Press OK. And there we go, we have YouTube in red and we have a black stroke. The next thing to add more than one stroke, you right click your text or even image. Then you come here and select Convert to Smart Object. You'll see from here you can no longer edit the text in terms of changing the font. So from here you come back to the effects, you go to Stroke, and guess what? You're able to add another stroke. You can see it's gone thicker. The reason for that is because we have a black on black. So if we change the color to red, and if we just make it a bit smaller, You'll be able to see it goes red, black, red, just like that, and you can press OK. You're not content with that? You want more strokes? Well, it's possible. If you right click it again and go to Convert to Smart Object, you can see it's now become the same how we did it before. So, again, come to the stroke. And this time, we can add a black. And we just go like this. OK. Put the stroke up a little bit more. Boom. And as you'll see, we have just put on four strokes on this piece of text. Now you can go on forever, you can go on as long as you want. However, four is probably enough for most people. Now what is the drawback of this? Well, you'll see, once you do convert it to a smart object, you can't convert it to a different font. Or, for example, you don't get the freedom to do other stuff with it. So if you wanted to make your text bigger, now you'd have to press Ctrl T in order to get the transform tool and then just hold shift and drag it out. And that is how you'll have to get your text bigger. But that is how simple it is to do multiple strokes in Photoshop. That is it for this tutorial, it's very simple to do. Like I said at the start of the video, if you'd like to request a tutorial, then be sure to leave it in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. With that being said, be sure to go follow me on Twitter where I'll keep you updated when you're posting and what you're posting. Also be sure to go ahead and check out my gaming channel where I'll post four times a week. And finally check out my Snapchat if you sure want to do throughout my day. See so you guys been casual savage here. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, rate, and peace.